All right. So you don't really see this matchup too often, actually, because you know it is mid-tier battle. You're not gonna see any of the, the more viable characters. But I feel like Dr. Mario is actually a, wow. Get bodied. And just like that, the double cape, uh, Tooling was not able to recover because he already did use his double jump, so he can only up -beat. Now, I don't know what, uh, I don't know what Chris is doing to suspend me down here, but probably a little discouraged about what happened. Alright, so. Alright, so lands with a fair. Pretty good. Uh, reads, reads the get up with a couple covers it with the down air. Oh, and he lost the stock. That all right. So pretty quick game one. Full spaghetti, but it is what it is. Blackthorn takes it, and we'll go on to game two and see what happens now. What happens now? Man, I don't know what's going on with this regular bracket. I think uh, we have V115 and Ice Ninja waiting in losers finals, <coughs> if I uh, recall correctly. Or, no wait, it would be... No, it would be um, Ice Ninja and Joe. Alright, so I'll uh, take a start. We got um, combos from both characters. Landing fair, gets him off stage. That's a very strong tool from Dr. Mario. Keeps the boomerang back. Uh, covers the roll with a dash attack. Well, drops you a little too early. He might have expected uh, the two link to snap onto the edge. Or try to go for some sort of punish, but got clipped by it. Oh, wow. That LP is really strong. Oh, and then reminiscent of the first stock in the first game and gets caped. Guess the first stock. Just is rolling around like it's for glory. Oh, nice. The down, down smash to cover the roll behind. I think he was picking up on the, the habit, so he was able to cover it pretty well. And Black just takes it 2 0. With two link, or with uh, Dr. Mario, I should say. All right, that was a 